help them reach record-setting mm -hmm. crowds? Because every year I used to, I've been covering this for years, it's always mm -hmm. rainy and drizzly. It's kind of part of the charm, but wow, Alex, it's good weather coming up, isn't it? Yeah, I think the weather looks fantastic as we head through the next few days for all the uh, outdoor activities. Of course, it's a busy weekend with some uh, Halloween festivities happening too. We are dry this morning though. No big issues start today. It's the live view from Coleman. Just a couple of clouds out there. No organized cloud cover to speak of, so not anything really to uh, pick out on satellite this morning. Temperatures in the 50s and 60s to start the day. Depending on how cold natured you are, you might want a jacket for the next couple of hours, but temperatures will trend up quickly. Upper 60s by 9 o'clock into the 70s as we head into the late morning and early afternoon with temperatures topping out in the low 80s today. As we head into tonight, pretty comfortable. Temperatures dropping down into the low 60s for most of us before sunrise tomorrow. Again, a couple of neighborhoods down into the 50s. A comfortable evening across the state of Alabama. We stay dry over the next few days, too. We'll go to the future cast. A few clouds, yes, but a lot of sunshine, too, as we head through this afternoon. We'll do the same thing again for Friday, and hey, guess what? We'll stay dry and warm on Saturday, too. So the weather looking good over the next few days. Uh, weather not going to be an issue for high school football. Thursday evening and Friday evening games, weather looking good. Temperatures generally starting in the 70s for games, dropping down into the 60s by the second half. The weather going to be warm as we head into this weekend. If there's any complaint, it's going to be that it is a little bit toasty in the middle of the afternoon, at least for this time of year, with those temperatures topping out in the mid 80s. Weather in Tuscaloosa on Saturday looking good for the uh, uh, Oktoberfest celebrations. Temperatures will be in the 80s for that by the afternoon. Weather looking good as we head into Friday, Saturday and Sunday evening too uh, for any trunk or treat or trick or treat plans that you and the kids may have overall. Hard to complain about a forecast that looks like that. The only complaint anybody might have is that we do need some rain. We do have a cold front on the way Monday, but we don't really see any rain with this, but a significant drop in temperatures on the way as we head into Halloween and the 1st of November. So let's talk about how cold things get. This is Tuesday morning, Halloween morning. Temperatures in the 30s and 40s. It's likely to get even a little bit colder than this as we head into Wednesday morning. Serious cold on the way, not rain though. No substantial rain across the state of Alabama over the next seven days. We're running behind when it comes to rainfall in central Alabama. And so for those who are dealing with drought conditions, that's a problem for and that's going to be a continuing issue. But it is going to be beautiful as we head through the rest of this week. And I'm looking forward to some cooler air as we head into next week. Kristen, how's traffic looking this morning?